the people it's your boy sticks representing urban legend gaming back with some more final fantasy 16 man again we appreciate y'all for clicking on this video man it means so much to me every time you guys definitely click on the video uh and also too is greatly appreciated if you guys are new to the channel man welcome yo welcome definitely like the video help your boy out subscribe to the channel if you're new ding the bell man that helps you be notified when we drop news reviews tips tricks walkthroughs and shorts here on the channel man you guys are awesome salute to every last one of y'all let's get into the video and be legendary what do you want to say farewell we're leaving. Good decision. Better that than buried out there in the black. You've got a lot to thank that girl for, you know. I know. And I will. Now, what do you really want? We both know that you don't come here for conversation. <laughs> Chassis. I mean, this could be. All right, let me see what else she got real quick. I think I'm gonna buy a. St I'm gonna buy a sword and try to see if it's something that we can upgrade at some particular point. It'd better all be here. So I, yeah, I don't want it. I don't, don't want to keep it. Um, not, um, no, I do want to keep it, but let me see something real quick. Okay, so this is these are necklaces. Um, definitely don't want to sell these because do I got these equipped right now? So I got a lot of, yeah, I'm trying to decipher what is useful and what is not. <laughs> Off you go then. I'm best of luck. I should probably say thank you to Gav too. So your mind's made up, is it? We'll be leaving for Rosaria as soon as we're able. Back down memory lane, eh? Rosaria ain't what she used to be, Clive. And not since the Imperials moved in. First sign of trouble, you make straight for Martha's rest and ask for the landlady. She's a friend of the cause. Tell her you was Sid, and she'll help you out. Understood. Thank you, Gav. Yeah. I'd be lost without you. Yeah, I'm just doing my job. No need to make such a fuss. You take care, all right? Oh, I'm crap at goodbyes. Where's Sid when you need him? Give him my regards when he gets back. I will.
Sorry to keep you waiting. Ready, my lady? Ready. That's crazy. Back where we started, guys. Yo, this this all oh, looks really really cool. I like this map layout thing that they got going on here. All right, three reads. Let's go get it. Area. It's been 13 years. But this breeze, the smell of the grass, it's just as I remember it. You haven't been back either. I couldn't. Brand did keep a close watch on each other in the Imperial Army. You'd get beheaded just for knowing a deserter. The only way out was on a mission. I see. Mostly I was afraid. Afraid to go back. I know. But I'm here now. to you. We should press on. Homecoming. <laughs> that's that's fitting. That's in at the top of the hill must be Martha's rest. Gav said the landlady's a friend. But can we say the same for her patrons? Imperials don't tend to take well to those with my mark. If anyone asks, I'm a branded soldier, sworn to protect my noble mistress. Seed, like sick of Togo. There, boy, that's enough. Get him, boy. Get him over here. There, boy. <laughs> sick of Togo. Get him, boy. Back to the mission. <laughs> oh, get him, boy. Yo, it just came out of way. Get him, boy. That thing sick of toggle. That thing's 
Trey survived. They never finished building the bridge then. After what happened at Phoenix Gate, it didn't seem the highest priority. Oi! Stop and give... Here! You couldn't give me an hand, could you? Typical. A bloody bearer. And just when I thought my luck had changed. Still, better a crumb of crystal than an empty hand, I suppose. Though it pains me to use another man's branded. Here, you understand me, don't you? I need your help. <laughs> These blasted birds must have caught whiff of my cargo, and now they've got me surrounded. And it was running late as it was. I've got something special needs delivering before the rest, but I dare not leave my cart untended. You couldn't run it up to Martha's rest for me, could you? Needs to get there a quick mind. Oh, sure, why not? Fine. That's the spirit. All right. Here. You hand that to the stable master and no one else. I'm owed a little something for it. If he gives it to you, pass it along to your master by way of thanks. Be off with you then. And don't go taking any detours on the way. Alright, so I guess. Alright, so we'll, we'll do that. Just hit straight there. Here we are. Martha's rest. Good girl. You get some rest now. Are you the stable master? I was asked to deliver this to you. This is for me, right enough. Not sure what some bearer is doing bringing it to me, though. Where's that fool of a peddler got to? He couldn't come himself. His cart's surrounded by wild chocobos. Hmm. Huh. Sounds about right. <laughs> have it full of Gizal Greens, no doubt. Crammed with him, if I know him. Gizal Greens? Chocobos go mad for them, don't they? And if you forget to seal the cart up tight, the smell gets out, and birds come running from miles around. Don't get me wrong. They're a fine investment for a savvy merchant, especially around these parts. But you can't get greedy, as our mutual friend is learning the hard way. Still, I got my wares, and that's all that matters. Be sure to pass your master my regards. <laughs> Yo, the way they be running is cracking me up, bro. I wonder if Martha is as friendly as Gav claims. Let's go and find out, shall we? When he goes to East, bro, leave him in the pod. Excuse me, would you happen to be the landlady? Depends who's asking, and why they have an imperial bearer with them. For protection, which hopefully won't be needed, if you can advise me on the safest route to the west. It's your friend here I'd be worried about. Ah. Bearers don't have an easy time of it in Rose area. Even a Stratton lad like him might attract the wrong kind of attention. And if he gets nabbed, it ain't likely to end well for you either. Then we'll just have to stay out of the militia's way. 
Gav said he might be able to help us. Follow me. Sorry for before. Can't be too wary of strangers asking questions in our game. I'm Martha, an old friend of Sid's. He said he had high hopes for a bearer who joined recently. I expect that's you. So, where is it you're headed? For Phoenix Gate. We have questions that need answering. Is that so? Well, if you want to avoid the garrison, the road through Eastpool's your best bet. Or it would be, if the bridge hadn't collapsed. A right blooming nuisance it is. We've had no trade with the village for weeks. I did ask our carpenter to take a look at it. But he went out on another job. And he hasn't come back. Do you think something might have happened to him? Fingers crossed <laughs> he's just taking his time. The alternative don't bear thinking about. We'll find him. And make sure he's safe. We both need that bridge repaired. And your carpenter sounds like the man to do it. I see why Sid's got such a soft spot for you. If you could, I'd be in your debt. You said that he went out on a job? Right. He went down into the marshes to check on another bridge. The one by the Fallen Gate. The marshes were dangerous at the best of times. We should hurry. There's a ladder to the side of the gate. That's the quickest way down, if you've a head for heights. His name is Bernard. Should you find him well, Bernard. tell him Martha sent you, and that he's wanted at the bridge to Eastpool. Let's do it. To the marshes, then. Let's find that ladder. Some love, man. All right. Um, he goes to Eastport. Here's the gate, and that must be the ladder. Yeah, man. This this game has been definitely a. Uh, how y'all get the hours of it? Um, I don't care what you're. Yeah, definitely. Oh shoot! It came from under the bridge. Come on. There he is. Hold on, we're coming. Thank you, my lady. You saved my life. Not at all. You're Bernard the Carpenter, yes? I am. I, I didn't realize my name was known so widely. I'm a friend of Martha's. She asked us to come and find you. Well, I'm very grateful for it. I just finished checking these piles when I turn around, I see a gang of slavering monsters looking to, to feast on my flesh. <laughs> if you hadn't Slabber. come when you did, I'd have been snipped into strips by now. We're just glad you're safe. Oh, I best go and give my regards to the landlady then, eh? Actually, she asked that if we found you, we should beg you make haste to repair the bridge to Eastpool. Of course. I, I said I'd take a look at it, but uh, it, it clean slipped my mind. I'll head up there straight away. Nice. 
Get that bridge done, boy. <laughs> Probably was a bad choice of wording right there. Get that bridge done, man. <laughs> oh, the trusses are still sturdy. It's just a matter of replacing the stringers and relining the deck. I'll have it done in no time. Thank you, Bernard. We were hoping to take the road to Eastpool ourselves. We're very grateful for your help. And sorry for asking this of you after what you've been through. I owe you my life. Fixing a bridge is the least I can do. Thank you, my lady. And you too, son. You're with Sid, ain't ya? Me and him, we go way back. Not as far as Martha mine, but far enough. I see. Well, I best get cracking then. You go and let Martha know I'm all right, and she'll have her bridge back soon enough. We will. The bridge will be fixed when it's fixed. I was wondering, like, yo, where's the opening? It was good, honest work building the aqueduct. Ah, you're back. What happened? Did you find Bernard? We did. He's fine. And he'll have the bridge to Eastpool repaired soon. Oh, well, thank the founder for that. It was lucky we found him when we did. The creatures out there are not to be trifled with. Trifled. It's the Blight's fault. They'd nothing to eat in the north, so they come down here hunting for food. He can't keep going out alone. I'll have to arrange a guard for him. But anyway, thank you. I don't have a lot to offer in return, but you're welcome to rest here until the repairs are finished. We'd be delighted. Give us our pay. Give us us free. Can I get you a drink or anything while you wait? Flagon of imperial gold, perhaps? Tastes like swill, but it'll slake a thirst. No, thank you. I prefer the truth about why there are so few bearers around here. Yes, there were more of them when we were young. Far more. Is this the Empire's doing? Have they been sent away? They have, I. Either to the Legions or Auriflam. Seems the miners at Drake's Head are having a hard time keeping up with demand of late. So the bearers make up the shortfall. Time was, they used to dole out crystals like sugar plums even down here in the provinces, but not anymore. Nowadays, they'll jump at any excuse to confiscate our bearers so they can be put to work elsewhere. I always knew the Empire treated their branded like shit, but after seeing it with my own eyes, well... Ah, Thea! Congratulations on the new arrival. And you got a little laddie with you. It was a bearer. The boy I carried for nine long moons. A bloody bearer. Oh, you poor thing. You gave it to the constables then. Just left it at the garrison, I Let them deal with it. Couldn't wait to be rid of the blasted thing. Been wanting it gone since the moment I found out. Well, it's all dealt with now. So no harm done, eh? Mum, you weren't my brother, was he? No, but you'll have one soon enough. You just have to be patient, all right? All right. <laughs> Unbelievable, isn't it? Bearers may have been looked down on back in Archduke Elwyn's day, but they were still human beings. Now they've fallen so far, a beggar wouldn't spit on them. Wow. 
Since you're not drinking, do me a favour and take that to the Abbey. There's a darkness at the heart of this world, and I'd have you see it. And we'll see it at an abbey. Glademond Abbey, on the shore of Sorrowise Bay. The abbot there is a friend. Tell him Martha sent you, and he'll show you what I mean. Understood. Oh, shoot. Make sure that's the only one because I've seen two two things there so I was like wait <laughs> are we uh this is just one thing that we don't oh what are you after uh, some merchant Something that we can actually uh, okay. As well. They got an elevator son? Yeah, that's crazy. I knew that children were tested. That a bearer's fate was decided at birth. And assumed it was best for all concerned. I know. But for a child to be blamed. To be hated by its parents through no fault of its own. We knew nothing of what it meant mm. to be born that way. Now let's Even. just go. No. Let's just go straight there. Obviously, we can't go to it. <laughs> I'm over here trying to run in the middle of the water. There, boy! You know what to do, boy! Get him! Sick of Toggle! Flames on there, boy. Over here. Thank you for the kill, me lady. There's the Abbey. What darkness awaits us within, I wonder. Let's go and see. Gloom Widow. At least it will let us run past it. to you I'm afraid the Abbey is not open for public prayer may Grieger go with you we came to offer a donation from Martha <sighs> uh. 
I see. Then please follow me. Uh oh. <laughs> he looked like he got some stories. I I never want to die. Please, father. Something for the pain. I beg you. The light it fades. I don't want to die alone. It's all right. I'm here. Who are these people? Martha's bearers. She entrusted them to my care, that I might ease their suffering. To the extent that I can. For the time they have left. has taken them. All of them. As it does every bearer forced to use their gift. With each draw on the ether, their bodies petrify, till all that remains is stone and pain, and so they are cast aside. There is nothing either Martha or I can do to change that, but we can at least strive to make their final hours a little more bearable. <laughs> Have faith, my son, for you shall rise again and find the happiness denied you in this life. Thank you. I must offer you my own thanks for the medicine you so kindly brought. Now that their final moments may be moments of peace. Damn. When next you see Martha, pray tell her that Two more have succumbed. We should get back to Martha's rest. Yes, we should. Yeah, yeah. Let's go. Fast travel over there? Fast travel. Yeah, that's, that's, that's quite of a run, man. It was good, honest work building the aqueduct. Let's go ahead and talk to her. Ah, you're back. Thanks for taking care of that. The abbot had a message for you. Two more have succumbed. I see. Come upstairs. So, now you know, eh? I've seen plenty of bearers die on the battlefield. But never like that. 
and all because they were born different. The powers that be can't take away their gift, so they strip them of their humanity instead. Oh, there's plenty who pity a bearer's plight. But so long as we're content to sit around, weeping for those on whose broken backs we're carried, we ain't gonna change nothing. And so you lend Sid your strength? What little of it I have. Used profits from this place to buy the poor buggers. So when the abbot told us the bearers were yours? Aye, they're my property, at least by law. Any still wow. fit to work fetch a price beyond my means. All I can do is care for those who are past mending. But it's not all doom and gloom. Bernard's finished fixing that bridge for you. You can carry on to Eastpool now. You got questions that need answering, ain't you? Well, I wish you luck. Thank you, Martha. Oh, I almost forgot. Sid and I have other friends in Rosaria. Wear this, and they'll know you for one of us. And know that you will always be welcome here. Hey. Wild as hell. You were right, Sid. It really is them. Lord Rosfield and Lady Warwick have come back to us. And long may they stay. Oh, so they do know him. Ah. <laughs> so y'all know. Sid. Ah, Clive. You're not where I left you. Hurt your hand. I did, aye. With a thousand little lightning bolts. Can't fling them around the way I used to. Think of it as my decoration for long service and exemplary misconduct. <laughs> to compare war wounds. We didn't. Thank you, Sid. For everything. <laughs> if you want to leave, that's your lookout. I'm sure you'll have a long and happy life together if you stay out of my way. Sid! <laughs> oh. you a girl back in the day she was a slave to her fate just like you I wanted to save her for a while I even thought I could but just because you think something doesn't make it true Sid Savior, just a conceited old fool. I talk about people forging their own futures, but instead of handing them the hammer, I beat them with my own. And if no bugger wants to listen to what you've got to say, you might as well keep your gob shut. <laughs> but Clive, I will say this. a monster. You're the same man you've always been. Except that, and you may yet escape your fate. My fate? Look, lad, you've had a hard life. 
And I don't see it getting much easier. You might not be able to save anyone else. But at the very least, you can save yourself. <laughs> I'll try. And Jill. I'm sorry we didn't get a chance to talk. But I trust you'll take good care of the boy. Yes, I will. Is that the last of it? Aye. We'd best head back then. Wouldn't want to keep Nan waiting. So right, then. What I'll do um, is I'll stop the video right here, man. Again, it's greatly appreciated, man. It's a work week coming up, man. So might slow up uh, with videos just a little bit. Uh, I'm going to try to see if we can play as much as we possibly can. Uh, but uh, sometimes those work days get, get your boy uh, <laughs> a little winded, man. So... Um, I appreciate you guys definitely for clicking on the video, man. If you guys made it this far in the video, man, drop a comment. Also, man, leave a muscle emoji in the, in the uh, comment section as well, man. It's greatly appreciated, man. It shows that you guys uh, have definitely been uh, chilling, vibing, and hanging with your boy, playing through uh, some Final Fantasy 16, man. Hopefully, all these videos help you out, get to, um, you know, finish the game or get you to a certain point. And stuff of that nature, man. That's what it's all about, man. Helping other gamers be the best version of themselves, man. You know, I greatly appreciate y'all. Salute to y'all. Um, also, too, man, if you guys are new to the channel, don't forget to like the video before you get out of here today. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. Ding the bell, man. Helps your boy out. Salute to every last one of y'all that do it. And I'm going to catch you to the uh, catch you guys in the next video. Until then. Legendary.